good morning everyone today i am going to tell something about uh, how can you learn english okay so uh, first of all i am going to tell how can you write english okay in order to write english you must know grammar okay so what grammar we have to know so basically we have to know uh, all the grammars uh, after uh, we practice to write correct English so starting from starting from letter onward okay letter word sentence parts of speech the verb is very very important and tense is also very important okay tense and verb we we have to think once it okay so therefore what you do you should know all the verbs because verb is the only word which we cannot escape in the sentence okay so that's why you should know all the verb list okay so initially try to learn the verb list and try to make sentences of each of the verbs the present form the past form and the past participle form okay so the basic structures you will get in the 12 tenses okay the 12 in the 12 tenses you get the basic structure as view okay so the first is as view subject verb object so this is the assertive form okay so how can you make interrogative form okay this also you should know so interrogative negative then take questions all the uh, forms of all the structures you should know so when you know the structures to make sentence then the requirement is words okay you have the frame so when you know the structure that means you need the frame okay when you have the frame so you have to fill up fill up the frame okay to build the house so words are words are the bricks okay so you have to, you have to build your house step by step so how can so the words where you will get the word yes of course you have to read books read english books there's one my favorite book okay i just show you for example that you have to read books this is also for spoken english books and this is also okay phonetics books so books not the three books all although so you have to read many books so although there are many books you have to select which book you can digest at what level you are so if you are in a basic level so try to read uh, the story books written for children okay children books are very uh, easily written and if uh, you were in higher standard um, suppose you were in class uh, high secondary level or degree level then you can try to read novels okay so what kind of novels will pick up to read so if you uh, if you want to read a very uh, easy easy going type novel then um, i will recommend some novel okay so the novels we are abridged for children so these novels you can read okay david coverfield and there are many books we are abridged in a short form written and these are uh, written for the uh, children okay these novels you can pick up and read gradually gradually you can go uh, to the english writers novel but before you go to english writers novel if you try to read the novels written by our indian authors okay these are not so difficult okay uh, i have read a few books written by okay indian authors so you can also try the english, english teacher bachelor of arts okay 
then Kantopura yes then this type of books you can read so these books are not so hard at the preface of Kantopura the famous line is written what is the famous line if you are doing this literature students you know okay that the author writes that we cannot write like the English writers okay whatever we will write uh, we will write like the Indian okay Indian writers so our English English Indian English is a different type of English so we do not uh, uh, write the hard words or hard vocabulary we do not use okay this type of books you can read Arkan Narayan, yes, the author is Arkan Narayan. Arkan Narayan's books you can read, okay. So there are many other authors, so you can follow. Then another thing I want to tell is that uh, it is not that only the Indian authors write CD. So you can read Ernest Hemingway, A Farewell to Arms. I uh, read the book and The Old Man and the Sea. So this type of book is also you can read but first when you read do not uh, bother of the different words just keep on reading and casually so sometimes you uh, check the word in dictionary and not every time you check the word in dictionary because it will it will hamper how to read you know your flow of reading it will hamper okay so you can mark that uh, difficult word then suppose you are sitting in a vacant mood then you can see all the words in dictionary then again you can proceed okay so i tell you how you can learn english to write and to read yes so every every aspect is uh, linked okay speaking uh, listening reading writing okay so every four aspects are linked okay and the self-talking so if you want to talk in english so self-talking will help you okay don't do not follow others think that you know okay so if you do not know then find try to find the word okay talk in front of mirror or you can make videos like me okay so this will also help you or when you are working, when you uh, drive your car, or when you ride your bike, then uh, you can talk with yourself. If you are sitting, uh, then then also you can talk with yourself, and you can write your diaries. Um, so my first writing, okay. So when I was in MA, as so what I did in previous uh, year. So in PG first year, then what I I did I did I tried to write every every day's dream. So maybe short, maybe long. So I tried to write in simple English. Then at the end of the year, I have finished my diary. So I saw that uh, I have written I have written a uh, almost book size uh, book size diary. That uh, this is my first okay initially i uh, try to write uh, something suppose poem i try to write i try to write a story also but uh, this was the first time i write regularly every day i write okay so you can uh, maintain this or you can write your plan in a uh, in a notebook so that so the notebook will help okay so notebook notebook will help you when you write uh, your thoughts in the notebook okay have any any thought your uh, anxiety your uh, whatever plan anything you can write but write in english so it will help you to develop your language and also uh, your uh, thoughts will be clear so you will be free from anxiety also okay thank you very much if you like my video then do not uh, forget to subscribe to my channel and like it thank you very much